Last night, Clico hosted an open discussion at Northwood High School on the specifics of carbon capture or sequestration. Yeah, just a few minutes down the road, Clico has a project in the works to bring carbon capture technology to its Boyce power plant. Back in April 2022, Clico introduced Project Diamond Vault. Colin Vidros has the latest. Clico's Project Diamond Vault aims to retrofit Brain Energy Center's Madison 3 units with carbon capture technology. Clico says it would capture 95% of emissions from fossil fuel burning facilities and store them underground in saline formations. At an open meeting held at Northwood High School's cafeteria, an educator and engineer presented what carbon capture sequestration even is and how it can play a role in helping to keep energy cost effective. But there were concerns. Would we be having this conversation right now if, if the federal government wasn't subsidizing this carbon sequestration? Many in the audience raised questions over how this project will impact them. I just, I just don't see that this is being saved down the line. I mean, right now, maybe. But we talk about, we talk about millions of years of this stuff being in the ground. That's my grandkids and great, great grandkids that I'm thinking about. That seems crazy to me. Dr. Mark Zappi is the director of the Energy Institute of Louisiana and gave a presentation on the pros and cons of carbon capture sequestration. He says while the project is very controversial, he claims carbon capture sequestration will benefit central Louisiana. Well, I think it's, it's a good thing because, first of all, it gives us uh, a method to manage our carbon dioxide. And second, it's based on technology that's been around from the 70s. So when you look at this overall process, it's, utilize, it's utilizing technology that's been around for a long time. So it's proven technology. For Zappi, his goal as an educator and engineer is to keep people informed about safer ways to use carbon. For me, as an engineer and as an educator and as somebody that comes in there as a non-biased, uh, it means a lot to me to sit with the community and answer their questions, look at their concerns, and I learn a lot from them. What, what, are, that, what are their concerns? What can I do to be, be a better, do a better job explaining things? Zappi says while he's not part of Clico, he believes carbon capture sequestration will not involve increased utility rates. Clico has also maintained that they do not expect any rate increases. In Lena, Colin Vidros, News Channel 5, your local station. Now, we did reach out to Clico to see if their environmental study would conclude in late 2023. They said the study will now conclude in 2024.